Hey crypto gang, ho, we're all doing well. Back here today with another tips video. As you guys always know, I go through the stuff that I find and when I find something I think you guys should know about, I share it. Now, I'm gonna be very honest with you, just found this out a couple of weeks ago and even though it seems really obvious, it was not something that I was aware that I needed to do. Today we're going to be talking about MetaMask. Now, as you guys know, this is a de decentralized wallet, um, but I just want to make sure that you all know about this trick that I'm going to actually do live with you guys so that you guys can avoid, you know, I guess not adding the security that you should have or not doing the things that you need to do. So, as you can soon see, as soon as I click on that MetaMask extension, I get this welcome back. Everybody should have a password on their account so that when they log in, they should enter their password. Okay, so make sure you've got that set up. Let's go ahead and put in our password. Click on unlock and that is going to take me into my current smart chain wallet. Now, the reason I wanted to use this wallet is because this one doesn't have that many tokens, so hopefully it won't confuse you too much. Now, this little option here says not connected, which is a good thing. And I always thought that was enough. But lo and behold, if you have ever connected your MetaMask wallet, Smart Chain or Ethereum, you need to make sure that you are disconnecting from all those sites that you've had connected at some point. So I know my main wallet has a lot, but I'm gonna try and look at this one today. So we're gonna go three dots here and you're going to click on connected sites. Lo and behold, oh my God, there is a whole bunch of sites, probably sites that, that I am no longer connected to. Guys, it is our job to keep these wallets safe simply click on the word disconnect and you are out i probably don't know what half of these sites are now what i may decide to do and when i get to those i will definitely let you know there may be certain accounts for example my ens account is linked to this wallet so i don't necessarily want to disconnect that um, because then I'm going to forget which one I linked it to. Same with my uh, Flash token. So we're going to leave those connected. Multi-chain, nothing there. Don't know what that is. Have used it at some point. Don't have anything on that site right now. Uniswap, the same. Wow. So as you can see, guys, I'm not going to bore you with this. Very important. One more time, you're going to go to each and every wallet if you've got more than one account. I am currently here on the airdrop wallet. You can see here, if I was connected to a site, then you can see that that would say connected, but it doesn't say not connected. And then you're gonna go into connected sites and you're going to disconnect all of those sites. Now, I just thought I'd quickly check um, to see if there are any BSC sites. Uh, for example, this one, so this one is Bank, pancakebunny.finance that at some point I may have had something on. So I'm just going to click on enter there. I honestly do not think. But see how straight away it knows who I am? Guys, that's not a good thing. Um, I don't believe I've got anything here. Let me just quickly go into uh, dashboard. Active positions. Yeah, I don't have anything in there. So you're not going in to sign out on each site just go up here metamask extension and as you can see it now shows connected so from here it's just going to allow you to connect but you can either go this way so three dots here and disconnect this account and if i then go back to the connected sites that site of pancake dot binance pancakebunny.finance dashboard should disappear and it has guys i really hope it helps it is really our job to keep our crypto assets safe our digital assets you know in this crazy world of scammers and hackers there isn't a lot we can do because there are some very smart people out there 
but these this information that I'm sharing with you today should allow you to go in make sure you check your MetaMask wallets make sure you're disconnecting from all those sites um, that you shouldn't be there and hope this helps you stay safe hope you guys have a great day great afternoon great evening wherever you are and hopefully we'll catch up on the next video take care ciao ciao